Talk of Alabama, we have Susan Gordon from the Shelby County Arts Council to talk about an upcoming show. Welcome back. Thank you so much. And tell us about the upcoming show that you guys have going on. So this is our fourth annual December Artist Market, and we are featuring um, handmade items by local artists and artisans and craftsmen. Everything from handmade pens to pillows, to photography, paintings, hand-painted notebooks, pottery, um, handmade note cards, and also custom pet portraits. And let's not forget about the lovely scarf that you yes. have on today. I and love that. Yes, thank you so much. This was made by Sally Chu and a lovely bracelet by Stephanie Dykus and Candy Lundy. These are handmade pottery pieces that she strung. It's beautiful. So I love that. Now let's talk about the pins because those are very eye-catching. Yes, that's by Phil Morris. Um, and he hand spins the, the wood and then gets the, the pieces together mm -hmm. and all the little pieces and parts are handmade. That is lovely. Yes. Now, that would go perfect with one of these journals here that's been hand-painted or... Exactly. Hand it's a great Christmas gift, and his price points are very good. Now, tell me about the journal that would go perfect with it. So, that, that journal is by Edna Seeley. She's also a painter, and she teaches some of our art classes at the Shelby County Arts Council. And she hand-paints the journals with acrylic paint and seals them, and they're just beautiful, all one of a kind. Now, when you first came in, I was drawn to the little owls. I, I had to pick them up and play with them. But... <laughs> These are so cute. They are. They're made by Stephanie Dykus, and they're bud vases, and they're made of handmade ceramic stoneware, and they're all unique and original. And you can see the little holes on top for the buds. Yes. The Gerber yeah. daisies would look adorable in them. I bet. Those are really, really cute. And I love the color scheme, too, because that turquoise and brown is always in oh, yeah. fashion, no matter what year it is or what time of year. Tell us about this right here. So that's by uh, Madeline Carbonet, and she actually has a current exhibit at the Chelsea Library right now in Shelby County. And she's a very talented photographer and sells her, her photography and her calendars are really great. I bought her calendar last year. I'm going to buy it again this year. <laughs> very nice. And it's time to do that, too, because Tweet that's right. is right around the corner. That's right. Now, this pillow here, yes, that's made by Charlotte um, George and Vicki Smith. And they are just a fun little funky girls that like to make things together. They make everything. So they'll have a bunch of crafty, knitted things and sewn things for sale as well. Now, what is this set down here, the ceramic? So that's a platter by Candy Lundy, and that's ceramic stoneware. And she um, is just a very talented potter. And she sells her wares all around Birmingham and also at the Shelby County Arts Council. And she will have a ton of pottery. So that's this, a dip and chip. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It looks like a nice dip and chip for a party. And it's different. It would be a conversation piece, I would think. Oh, yes, for sure. Yes. And I love how it's neutral tones. It can go with any interior. Okay, and this, I remember an old chair like this on my grandfather's porch. <laughs> you don't really see these anymore. Yeah, so Pam Brittnell, is, that's her watercolor painting, and she has taken classes with us, and this is her second or third artist market with us. She always does really well. Her watercolors are just so beautiful and classic. And tell us about these little easels down here, because that's different. Yeah, that's Karen Ingram's work, and she um, just wanted to, you know, do little tiny paintings as good little gift items, so it can go anywhere on a shelf or on a desk. It's just a great little unique handmade gift item. And she also made these handmade cards right here, too. And these are her copies of her acrylic paintings. Oh, that's nice. Now, the two canvases that you have down here, who are those by? Okay, so the one on the bottom with the trees is by Shauna Harmon, and that's oil on canvas, Lovely. original painting. It's beautiful. I love those trees. Great colors for any interior. Um, she's just a very talented painter. She can paint anything. She actually started taking classes with the Arts Council about three or four years ago, never wow. really painted, and then has become a self-sustaining artist. She's That's very wonderful. talented. Um, and then this is Candy Lundy's pet portraits. She does pet portraits, custom pet portraits. You can oh, see nice. here's the original photo here, and wow. then the then the painting. So she is just a very talented um, lady, but she does takes commissions. So if you have a pet and you want a portrait done, she does them, and they're very inexpensive. So, and um, you can see all of this when. Okay, so the artist market is on Saturday, December the 1st, and it's from 9.30 to 3 o'clock, um, and it's at the Shelby County Arts Council in Columbiana, and it's uh, 104 Mildred Street. It's a great um, part of a great thing that they're doing in Columbiana called the Tour of Homes. So get out there and see the Tour of Homes, and also come by and see us at the artist market. And you guys do so much work uh, just helping artists hone their crafts. Yes. So I want to congratulate you guys on that, because well, that you. one painting right there says it all. Thank you. All right, and thank you for being here. Thank you. And uh, check it out this weekend. We'll be right back.